Welcome to Sports. We have some exciting news to break. I'm joined by recent Topeka West grad Elijah Brooks. Elijah, thanks for being here. Blessed and excited to be here. We're happy to have you, man. Uh, Elijah is the he led the entire state of Kansas in points per game on the basketball court this past season. He also became the all-time scoring leader in Topeka West basketball history. And if that's not enough, he was also the Kansas Basketball Coaches Association, Mr. Kansas Basketball. I think the list could go on. Just a few accomplishments. Yeah. We're not talking about that, though. The past is in the past. We're here to talk about the future. And Elijah joins us to announce what's next. He's made his college decision. And Mr. Brooks, without further ado, where will you be playing college basketball? I appreciate everybody who helped me along the journey. You know, I, I, I rock with all y'all, and thank you very much, but I'll be committed to the University of North Dakota. There we go. It's official yeah. now. You heard it here first right <laughs> on 27 News. He's going to play basketball at North Dakota. I want to ask you, what is it about North Dakota that made you say, that's where I'm going? Because you had a few offers out there. Um, what was it that you said, this is, this is my, my new home? Uh, it's the environment out there, you know, and I got to meet some of the players, and just off instant we just made a bond and you know some of them call me some time to time and I just like I don't know I really rock with it out there yeah I love it man I love it we're, we're certainly happy for you uh, uh, I think you're gonna do great things there uh, I, I thought and I told you this before we got on the show here I thought there should have been more D1 offers rolling in right uh, yeah. there wasn't as many for the guy who led the state of Kansas in scoring uh, does that feel you at all? Are you kind of going with a little chip on your shoulder into your college basketball career? Oh, yeah, it's definitely motivation, you know, because going into uh, North Dakota, playing some of the schools that were close that could have, you know, could have recruited me, uh, it's pretty good to get to show them, like, what I can actually do and not say, I wouldn't say, you know, make them regret their decision because I'm happy on where I'm at, but make them definitely second guess. You're going to be far away from home, but you'll still have the Topeka West family supporting you along the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, sure. Well, we're certainly rooting for you. I know another guy who's rooting for you, and that's your head coach at Topeka West, Rick Bloomquist. We actually talked with him earlier today. Let's go ahead and listen in real quick to what he had to say about your big commitment. Personally, I'm very proud of you. I feel good about it. Uh, for the program, it's a, it's a step in the right direction because it proves that kids can get to that spot if it's what they want. Quite the honor, obviously. He's a legendary coach here in the state of Kansas. I wanted to ask you, just tell me about the impact that he's made on your journey. Obviously, an awesome coach, and I got the impression you guys are pretty close. Oh, yeah, definitely. He let me do, from the get-go, he let me, you know, play into my own game and, like, build myself as a person. And then he was, he was there for me mentally. So, you know, I feel like that's one of the most important parts of the game, having some support behind the scenes, you know, and people not seeing what's going on. You know, he worked on me. He worked with me a lot, you know, throughout my career every day. If I ask him to get in the gym, he'll let me in the gym. So it's just a lot of stuff that people don't see that he does, and I really appreciate it for him. Absolutely, man. Well, hey, thanks for being here. We're glad you could announce it here on 27 News. We're certainly glad that we were able to be a part of the big, the big decision, the big yeah. announcement. And like I said, I think the whole city of Topeka is going to be rooting for you. you got a lot of fans here. We'll be watching yeah. from far. We'll be ESPN Plus probably or whatever. We're going <laughs> to figure out a way to – maybe we can get North, North Dakota games live here on uh, KSNT. All right, bet.